Hello everybody. Waiters. Oh. <laughs> and we are here with our exciting journey of skin. I'm Tony. Myself Dina. And we are taking you to the world of skin. So right. this is our first episode. Uh, we hope that the, the knowledge what we're going to share in this video will help you to get a good knowledge about the skin. So Hina, that's our first episode. Yes. Are you excited? I'm very excited. <laughs> As um, I have been seeing people, they just take about talk about the skincare itself. Yeah. They don't talk about the skin. Yeah. So I'm very excited, and thank you for bringing that um, on it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Hina. Now please take us to the journey of skin. So what exactly skin is? and yeah and how it functions i'll try my best to explain everything thanks for being <laughs> yeah. um so first thing the skin is a main organ in our body as you can see we have the skin all over our yeah. body yeah. and it protects us from getting injured or any bacterial infections or any environmental changes which our skin feels and it just let our brain know that oh something is not right. Yeah, I try it. Feeling hot, feeling <laughs> cold. Yeah. So all that you are feeling is through your skin. Mm. So you have to protect your skin from whichever way you can. Yeah. And I'll explain you a little bit how it works. Yeah. So our skin is around the eyelid. You feel it's thinner. Yeah. In around our palm, we feel it grow more thicker. Yeah. And all over our body, you feel it a little bit average, not thicker or not thinner, depending on individual skin. Yes. Yeah. You feel it like somebody's skin is more thicker than the others. Yeah. So it all depending on your genes so whatever you have got it from your parents <laughs> or your ancestors. Yeah. yeah. So uh, the skin on your eyelid is more thinner. It's only one mm thickness across. Wow. Yes. Okay. And on your palm is around three mm, which yeah. you sometimes you feel it. It's more harder than your normal skin. Yes. So it's God have made us the way that you can handle things easier. Yeah. With your hard skin on your palm. Yeah. Or your feet. Yeah. And rest of the body is approximately. To mm and depending on individual as I said previously right and it also comes in a layers like it's epidermis dermis and hypodermis right all the layers works according uh, according to protect our body body from getting any bad influence from outside yeah it can be anything the epidermis is like the outer layer of our skin and it acts as a shell so sometimes you feel it like i'm feeling hot and straight away you feel that all oh, my body is sweating yeah. so that sweat is there to protect your body and make it feel cooler yeah. and also when you are out in the sun straight away you feel that you you are burning but you are not burning as such yeah. because your body is trying to protect you from the heat, heat. or uv rays mm. so that's actually the topmost layer which everybody can see it yes so this is right. this is what we have epidermis right yes and uh, this is a protective layer that's amazing yes, so it um, it's quite fascinating world about the skin that like you know it it acts as a barrier yes and it has a lot of functions to protect our body like the internal organs from the outer infections yes. and so it is really important to look after that barrier Yes, <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's very important because sometimes you are just thinking about our outer layer, yes. as I just said, like it is protecting us, but yeah. then you also have to look deep into it, which Absolutely. is dermis, yeah. uh, which has our blood cells, um, we have our hair follicles, um, it also have our nerves, which yes. feel the sensation and everything. Yeah. And our collagen and elastin, which oh, is yes. our skin needs definitely in any age. Any age. Any age. So oh, like the more you grow, you are producing everything less. Yeah. So you have to start protect, protecting your skin 
yeah. from the younger age to look younger over the age of 50 or <laughs> yeah that's a magic you know if you are protecting your inside as well definitely yes. yeah it will give you a really good results yes it's it's not always uh, how you look outside it also inside as well yeah. so as I, as I said, it's epidermis and dermis. So outer layer looks different, internal layer look, looks Look different. different. Then, yes. When you see the picture of epidermis, dermis, and then hypodermis, it's like you just feel like, yeah. oh, I don't want to see the inner layer <laughs> because it's looking ugly. Yeah, you can see up there. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And um, because of that, uh, we just care more about epidermis than dermis. Yeah. So we have to also keep our eating habit, uh, water take, water intake, uh -huh. and um, how is our sleep, what kind of makeup we are wearing, or yeah. whatever you are doing, it yeah. needs to work oh. with the internal and external both. Both. You yeah. Really important to look after the health from inside to get a good glow on to yes, out, definitely. outer skin, right? Yes. Okay, so what's the next layer? So next layer is hypodermis, yeah. which is very deepest layer of your skin, right? which insulate the fat cells and it makes your skin feel like cushion. So sometimes when you touch your skin, you feel like, oh, it's getting oh, like yeah. a cushion. <laughs> this, is, this is what like, sometimes we always call it, like skin is more like a sponge. Sponge, that's so, right. So that actually, because of that hypodermis layer, yes. which actually um, sitting feels on like sit, sitting on. Yeah, very deepest layer. layer. That's, that's right. right. That's quite exciting. It is exciting. Yeah. yeah. Everybody is like, oh, you apply this, you are going to get fair skin, or you you have more glow, glowing skin, or do this, do that, or maybe some TikTok <laughs> home remedies, DIY videos. So good yeah. and bad, good yeah. and bad, depending on what you are catching up, catching from. up from there. Yeah. So this is what um, our first episode was about: the education of the skin, and we hope that we have covered a lot of things in there that can actually help you to understand about the skin so in our next video we will share with you about the skincare products and how it's gonna work for you thank you so much for your time today for listening uh, to the conversation what we had today and we hope that you got a really good knowledge about the skin and its layers how they function thank you so much Hina for your time today thank you and thank you to our lovely audience as well stay tuned please like subscribe and share the video yes. if you like the content and yeah please your comments are really important for us yes. so please give us a feedback Bring your questions if you have anything which you would like us, us to, to cover in our next video. Yes. So that will motivate us to create a really good content for all of you. Thank you once again and have a lovely day. I'm Tony. And myself, Nina, signing off. Bye-bye.